Good morning, YouTube. Woo! All right, you guys, this is a multi-channel collab called If You Could Only ha Pick. If you could only have 10 eyeshadow palettes, what would it be? What would they be? Like, if you had to just narrow that sucker down, you can only have 10 eyeshadow palettes, nothing more, nothing less. What would your favorites be? What would you pick? I thought it was going to be all my Jeffree Star palettes, but it's not. It's not. I'm kind of surprised. There's a mix of um, things in here and in no particular order. So how this is going to work is there are two groups, 13 people, group one, group two. I'm in group two. So some of the ladies are doing giveaways. Some are not. If you... Enter a giveaway in group one. You must follow, no, subscribe to everyone in group one, all channels in group one. If you enter a giveaway in group two, you must subscribe to all the channels in group two. They will be checking. I am not doing a giveaway. I just did two of them. I still have one more to go that I will be picking for tomorrow on Mask Monday. So I'm not going to do a giveaway today, not in this one. Um, but let's go ahead and see what 10 palettes I picked. Okie dokie. Okay, in no particular order. I went with. Um, Pure and Raw Beauty Christy. I love this palette. Do you guys see? Can you see the little drawings there? So pretty. Now, with Raw Beauty Christy, if you don't know, I've already hit pan on one of them, there is a neutral side. And then you flip it around, and there is a colorful side. This palette has gotten so much use and so much love. I love this palette so much. You, if I pick it for the week or two weeks, I have an automatic you know, colored look, neutral look. This palette is gorgeous. And I went through hell and back to get it, so there you go. This next one. This one reminds me of when I lived in Germany. This is the Nomad Berlin Underground palette. It is very grungy. Now the good, the really cool thing about Nomad Cosmetics, if you don't know, is they will go, they're a destination palettes. So they will go and source the ingredients from Berlin to make these eyeshadows. I have the Tokyo one. Um, the owners went to Tokyo and actually sourced all of them. All of them are like that. So I love this palette. It's very grungy, but it's very, very gorgeous. So there's my second one. My third one. Sorry, I don't have any makeup on today, you guys. I'm literally in the middle. Jeremy and I are switching bathrooms. Um, when we first moved into this house, he took the bigger bathroom. I took the smaller bathroom. I thought it would be fine. It wasn't because I have so much stuff. So we switched and he hardly has anything. And I just kept seeing all that space that he wasn't using that I could use. So I'm like, Ooh, we need to switch. so he said, yes. So that's what I've been doing all day is getting all my stuff over to the big bathroom. Thank goodness. Oh, you got a little schmutz on you. We'll get that taken care of. This is, this was gifted to me. Um, this is the, I literally, Viseart. Viseart palette. Um, you are 01 neutral matte. Now, I did have the other little one picked out as well. Um, but I had to put it back because I remembered a, a Jeffrey palette that I 
I love even more. And it's a staple, so. This one's gorgeous. I do love it. Another great neutral. Don't worry, the colors are coming, I promise. This one, I love it. I have a hard time with her, though. I don't know. I'm trying to get back into watching her. I just... I, but the palette is amazing. It's the Tati Beauty. I know. It's another neutral palette. I know. But it's just so freaking gorgeous. You literally could take this whole row and make an eye look. Same with this one. Or you could even... Well, no, you can't go that way. Just go this way. It's just so pretty. So stinking pretty. And the formula is amazing. The mirror is ginormous. The black is black. I mean, I just can't. And the I, and she made it look like a book. Like this. Can you guys see that? On the spine. The idea was that she was going to do more volumes, colors. But then, you know, all hell broke loose with the Jeffree Star, uh, Shane Dawson thing. And just, it wasn't just that it was her business partner or whatever too. So there's that. Oh, I forgot her ex business partner. Okay. The next one, this one is, I was told to throw this away cause she was a little chalky. The wet and wild 40 palette. You want to talk about color. She was $20 on the website. And look at all the colors in there. It's so pretty. And again, another palette that has been used multiple times. Because it's gorgeous. She a little chalky, but it's fine. She's just, it's fine. Okay, my next one. Oh, this one. The, the next two, the next three would be my top three. Like if I had to just have three, the, ne the next three would be my, ne my top three, which is the Jeffree Star Cremated Palette. Y'all, this is, this is my jam right here. I stinking love this palette. And I already hit pan in this one over here. I just, I just, I can't. I love it so much. Okay. And if y'all know me, you know what this one is. You just know. You just freaking know. It's the bloodlust. It's the bloodlust, you guys. It's so velvety and soft and pretty. Bam! Look at those colors. Like what? Look at that pink right there. Oh, my lanta. Oh, yeah. Okay. She's gorgeous. The packaging is bulky. Yes, we all know that, but she's pretty. All right, the next one. Orgy. I know she's another neutral. The, the the packaging is like that soft touch stuff, but y'all, she gets dirty fast. Like she is just filthy because of the the packaging. I know it's another neutral color. I know. I'm sorry. But look at the the mm, just mm. she's pretty. She's so pretty. I love her so so much. Okay. Here's another colorful one, though. It's the Jawbreaker. That's the big Jawbreaker. Now, there's your color right there. Bam! That's just summer right there. Summer! Oh, yeah. And if you guys have if you guys have tried any of Jeffree Star's eyeshadows, you know they are some of the best eyeshadows. Now, this last one was gifted to me as well um, and I absolutely stink and love it it's the glam light cake palette birthday cake palette well it's a cake palette but I got it for my birthday from my bestie one of my besties 
Is she still cute? I love the packaging. Glamlight um, did PR packaging. So it's a little stove, a little oven, not a stove. And it's just so cute. It has the nutritional facts on the back. Not really, but you know what I mean. And see, there's some more color for you. And it does have a mirror right there. It's so stinking pretty. Look at those colors. So those are my 10 palettes. That was 10, right? I think that was 10. Hopefully that was only 10. I could have picked some more, you guys. It was just crazy. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yes. Okay. So there are my ten palettes. Smile. Oh wait. That's right. I just not never mind. Okay. Okay, you guys, that's it. Please and thank you. Make sure you go follow everybody um, in group one if you're entering one of their giveaways. Group two if you're entering, well, I'm in group two. You know, not follow, subscribe. Oh, you guys, my brain. Okay, you guys, until next time. See y'all. Oh, wait, uh, Miss Gloria is, God, I keep forgetting to do this. Miss Gloria is the hostess of this collab. Miss Gloria, thank you so much for um, letting me join in. I greatly appreciate it. And until next time, y'all, see y'all later. Bye.